Green technology is creating new job opportunities in Hawaii. Add new products too that can save your business money. I'm Leah with Goldwing Supply Service and we are an aviation company here in Honolulu that specializes in niche solar solutions for aviation marine general illumination and traffic. Today we're here at the expo and we are launching our solar bollard product and it's one of the first in the world using the number one technology used within the U.S. Department of Defense. This lantern here is a temporary aviation taxiway lantern. We took the same technology and we, turned, we used an amber color to create this solar bollard. As you can see here, it slips right over. This solar bollard is, um, comes with an installation kit for quick mounting. A typical solar bollard will run you um, within the $1,200 range, which is a little bit more expensive than your traditional hardwire. But what we're talking about is a two-year return on investment, which is huge when comparing solar products. Solar bollards, in this case, are used to light driveways or pathways. And um, in a particular installation that we did on the Big Island, it was an 80-unit installation, and we saved them several hundreds of thousands of dollars in construction costs, permitting, trenching, and with a return on investment in two years. So quite impressive, they're really happy with it. This is made out of the sail mass material, which is anodized aluminum, and has a 10-year warranty. The light itself has a three-year warranty, so you've got a potential operating life of 10 years of product. So with the return on investment of two years, you're talking about eight years of green money. The same technology was manufactured by Carmana Technologies, and this is the same product that's used at a, a Department of Defense bases such as Pacific Missile Range, Tripler, Kaneohe Marine Corps Air Station, and they're used in uh, taxiway as well as obstruction lighting um, solutions. And at one point, we did install the world's largest solar remote controlled airfield in the world at Pacific Missile Range facility using the same technology.